Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft has rolled out a new Windows 11 Insider Preview build to the Canary Channel Insiders late yesterday in my region on the 7th of September. And this week's build is 25947. Now, when it comes to so-called hot off the presses features, there's not actually too much going on this week in the Canary Channel. Um, we get a Microsoft Store update, which we'll look at shortly. But over and above that, there's just fixes um, that have rolled out for previous known issues. Now, some of these fixes are quite important because they uh, affect the reliability and the performance of Explorer.exe. Now, just to go through some of these fixes, if you are interested in developments uh, in the Insider program, Microsoft has rolled out a fix that impacted the ability to type for some insiders. So that's a typing bug that has been addressed. And they fixed a few issues impacting Explorer.exe. So Explorer.exe, as many of you may know, is your taskbar, your start menu, your file explorer, and so on. So it's the shell of your OS. So a couple of these fixes are reliability and stability improvements that have rolled out. They also included a fix um, that fixes an issue that was causing File Explorer to crash. So that's an important fix. And then um, Explorer.exe wasn't working in safe mode for some users uh, in previous flights. So um, those are some important fixes that have rolled out for the shell of the Canary channel when it comes to the OS. Now, um, they also did some work to help improve the performance when switching between different pages uh, in the task manager. So basically, if you're heading from processes to performance to app history and so on, that bug has been addressed, moving from different pages in the task manager. And they also fixed an issue causing some insiders to see an unexpected pop-up after the latest snipping tool update for the actual snipping tool app. So those are the fixes that have rolled out for some of those previous known issues, which is always a good thing when known issues get addressed. And at this stage, though, there is one new known issue where some popular games may not work correctly in the Canary channel. And then just quickly mentioning that um, Microsoft Store update, uh, which I did mention yesterday in the beta channel uh, build that rolled out and those beta channel builds that were made available, where Windows insiders in all channels run in version 22308.1401 of the Microsoft Store and higher, we'll see the following improvement rolling out. You get a new Game Pass page, as you can see from the screenshot provided. And Microsoft says, with this new experience, you can learn about Game Pass benefits, such as exclusive games, deals, free perks, EA Play, and a whole lot more. So that's the um, Microsoft Store update rolling out now to all insiders in all channels. And that's more or less what's new. As mentioned, not too many hot off the presses things going on this week in the Canary channel. But nonetheless, just to keep you posted and informed regarding this latest build, 25947. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.